What's up, you guys? What's up? Hey, y'all. Hey, it's your girl, A. And today's wig video is going to be sponsored by Seely Hair. So let's just get into how your wig comes real quick. Ely Hair is an affordable lace front wig website where you can receive free gifts with each purchase as I'm showing you guys here. I'm not sure if it's always going to be the same thing. It may be different random gifts, but I did receive a bonnet, a headband, a wig cap, and a pair of their mink eyelashes, which are very fluttery and cute. These are their 3D mink eyelashes and hopefully everyone gets a pair of these Sealy Hair lashes when they purchase. Also, some of the wig clips, which you guys already know how much I love, an edge brush and a comb and the unit as well will come with a stock card and on the opposite side, it'll give you their social media handle. So this unit right here is a 16 inch 13 by 4 HD lace frontal, 100% human virgin hair and it is a deep curl. Now this is how your unit comes when you first get it. So if you feel like you cannot do bleaching, I'ma just tell you right now that you will need to bleach the knots in this unit. If I did forget to mention it is 180%, I'll leave all of Sealy Hair's information down below. So as you guys have seen on the mannequin, it does come with a pre-sewn elastic band inside of it. So if you can't do that, it already comes. And this is a 13 by four. And as you guys can tell from the sides, the hair is overlapping my ears. So I'm just gonna go ahead and customize this unit. But first and foremost, I definitely need to put the hair up. So I use my clips from the Dollar Tree or whatever you wanna call it, the Dollar Tree Plus store. And I part directly above my ear, wherever the wig is overlapping, I just take my comb and I part directly over my ear and the excess lace, I just cut it off. This is not gonna destroy the wig in any way. It'll make it fit properly. And this is a stock cap size. So, you know, you gotta customize some of these wigs to your liking. And I'm just gonna go ahead on the opposite side and do the same thing. And I'm gonna cut right into that part that I created. Now the fun part, cutting the lace off, girl. Let me tell y'all, I really did not think that this wig was gonna work out. Like for real, when I seen the lace, I was like, okay, I don't know about this. This is probably gonna really, really show on my skin. This is how I felt about the wig when I received it. You know, I bleached it with 30 Developer. I let it sit on the unit, I think for like an hour. And then I did tweeze some of the hairline. As you guys seen on the demonstration, like as I showed you how your wig comes straight out the packaging. The, the knots was kind of like, you know, speckled, so I had to hook it up. Now, this is what I use to apply my wigs and hold the curls in my wigs too, girl. I love me some Aussie Instant Freeze, been using it forever. This is the Instant Freeze. It says it will give you a 24 hour hold. I'm not really sure how long you can wear your wig with it because I do not sleep in these. I just take uh, some spray and I allow it to dry and then I'll spray like two or three layers on it. This one I only spray two and it dries quickly so you don't even need a blow dryer. Dependent on the lace, if it's like the old school thick lace, then girl, you're gonna need a blow dryer. But for this one, I just allow it to get tacky after like the second or third spray. And I just take my comb and just press it down. Now see, it does dry quickly. So this is what I'm talking about. You may not want to spray the entire perimeter because it does dry quick. So you will need to be quick about it. But I love this hairspray. It's super cheap. It's like $4 a can. You can get this anywhere. Aussie Insta Freeze. Been using it for years. And girl, let me tell you, I've only really used it for uh the most years for holding curls in my wigs like they this hairspray dries quick so it will definitely hold your curl your hairstyle okay but you see how this wig looks really natural and the lace just kind of like melted after it was adhered i was not expecting this from this wig like straight up i was not expecting the wig to work out like now if you missed a couple of spots when it comes to your lace 
application you can just spray some of the hairspray right onto the tail end of your comb and just split um you know stick that comb under the lace super easy or on top either way i love aussie it's a very easy cleanup because you do see a little bit of hairspray past my hairline it's a very easy cleanup versus the glue but you know you just do what you know it's good for you okay now I just decided to take some hairs and use them as, you know, adult hairs, senior hairs, whatever you want to call them hairs. Now see the lace actually worked out really good so I didn't even need any baby hairs. I thinned the wig really good and I didn't have to thin it too much because it wasn't that bad. Versus what you've seen in the how your wig comes, after I bleached it, it came out really nice, okay? I think this is the unit that I had to bleach twice. It is, this is a unit that I did end up bleaching twice. You know, I allowed it to dry overnight and then I noticed that it still was kind of speckled. So I did have to bleach this unit twice. So that's probably why it came out a, a lot better. But the, the lace fooled the hell out of me. You know what I mean? So if you're looking for an affordable wig, you can check out Sealy Hair. I'm going to just take that elastic band and I'm going to... I allow it to hold my hair in place as the product dries. This was called a deep curl on the website. I didn't like the looseness of some of the curls, so that's why you see me curling it right here. I just take the skinniest barrel in my collection and I just curl it on and then curl it right off. I'm not allowing the hair to rest too long on the barrel because I don't want the curls so tight. But I decided to just take the wand curler and curl a bit of it just to give it some curl. And it was mainly in the front area. It, the back was just perfectly curly. I didn't have any issues with the back hair, but it was just mainly around the hairline. And that probably is from me just, you know, messing around with it, applying it or what have you. But I noticed that the front was a little loose when it did dry. So I just decided, let me get my curling wand together. Once I take the, the hair off the barrel, I do pull the hair like so. That way the curls don't cool in a tight, you know, pattern. Check out Sealy Hair. They got some affordable units. I will post all of the info down below. This is the 16 inch 180% HD lace frontal 13 by four. And look at the hairline, like the lace looks nice. I just like to brush my hairs out. I don't like them really sticking to my skin. I like that, you know, it just gives it a little bit more natural look. Put on my earring again. And the density of it is decent. The length is decent too. This is a cute summer wig, you know what I mean? Cute little summer wig. If you wanna put on your little maxi dress or what have you and look cute on a budget and check out Sealy Hair. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll leave all of the information down below for you guys let me know what you think you know also you can receive 15% off with the coupon code below and I'll also link that as well um, and on that note I'm about to go see y'all in the next video I love you all stay diva and divalicious and make sure you rate comment subscribe share the video please and um, on that note I will see y'all in the next one bye